And certainly, I think that film laid the foundation stones for my eventual coming out. I mean, I came out at 21, which uh, um, that was 1991. So in those days, that was probably pretty much part of the course. I mean, I know these, these days people tend to come out much, much younger or don't need to come out at all, which is absolutely fantastic because it can be a harrowing experience. But I think for my own mental being, that helped me realise that I wasn't alone, that I wasn't a freak, that there were other people out there. And they were making films about it in a positive light. And obviously, as the years went by, I um, got myself a DVD of it and I've watched it. And, and I still enjoy occasionally having a glass of wine and sitting down and watching that film. It's um, a very interesting um, director. The way it's been directed is very interesting. And um, the story itself is, is, is quite positive. But like a lot of these things, it leaves you sort of dangling, wondering what's going to happen in the future. And I wanted them to walk away into the sunset and feel and get married and have lots and lots of children or whatever it is. Um, and that doesn't necessarily happen. But I, I quite like that sort of slightly anticlimactic ending because it, you, know, you could make it up for yourself. And certainly, I was able to draw on that through times of stress and anxiety. I'm a, um, I have a lived experience of mental distress and I've always found it very much a uh, a comfort and um, particularly being so early I mean it was 1985 and so obviously even by the time I was coming out it was already six or seven years old but it certainly for me started the journey of my eventual coming out and realizing that, that there was no need to feel guilty or or disgusted at, at, at who or what I was and that it was perfectly natural and perfectly acceptable and it was fine and if those lovely actors over whom I think were heterosexual but never mind <laughs> no disrespect to heterosexual people but um if yes both of those actors could do it then then yes i could too so i found it um enormously liberating and very very useful it it um certainly was something that i didn't initially discuss with friends but as i came out it was something that i was able to share and a lot of people have heard of this film and obviously it's a, a classic and yeah, I mean, I think it has been a weapon or a defence mechanism, whatever you want to call it, um, a tool that has helped me navigate the whole um, dangerous situation or difficult situation of coming out and dealing with all sorts of feelings of being gay and certainly helped me um, understand that there was light at the end of the tunnel and not to feel isolated, alone or, or feeling I suppose self-imposed homophobia, which is a lot of people, people with LGBTQ plus um, may experience at some point. Anyway, I hope that's helpful and thank you very much indeed.